Happening next weekend, the walk to defeat ALS is going on at the Indiana State Fairgrounds and Connie Simpson with the ALS Association is stopping by this morning. Great to have you here. Good morning. Thank you. First of all, for those who are not impacted by ALS, mm -hmm. tell us what this disease is. So ALS stands for amyotrophic lateral sclerosis or Lou Gehrig's disease. Um, it is extremely rare, approximately 5,000 people diagnosed annually in the United States. Uh, the impact of the disease is um, eventual loss of the ability to walk, talk, and eventually breathe. We have our families in Indiana uh, nationwide with this disease who um, have approximately two to five years to live after diagnosis, making the need for a fight for a cure even more urgent. Yeah, it's extremely debilitating and there's no cause, correct? There is no known cause or cure at this point. Yeah, you all do incredible work behind the scenes. I guess that has to be pretty rewarding for you all. It is. There are four of us care service coordinators here in Indiana who, um, who uh, help our families in the state. We also work with our donors. Um, we work with our home office. We have national partnerships, global initiatives in order to be able to fight the disease as well as our state and local advocacy efforts to fight for the rights of those who are impacted by the disease. It's approximately $250,000 a year to pay for the cost of ALS, including the care, the equipment, and that's not including the medications. Yeah. Tell us about the walk that's happening on Saturday. So the walk to defeat ALS is next Saturday at the Indiana State Fairgrounds celebration Park. Um, registrations at 8 o'clock. Walk and programming starts at 10 o'clock and we're really excited about it. Yeah, thank you Connie for stopping in. I'm mm -hmm. excited to join you on Saturday and if you would like to be a part of the walk to defeat ALS, we do have more information on how you can sign up in this story on WTHR.com. We'll be right back.